The Battle of Matakito was fought in the Araco War on April 30, 1557, between the Spanish forces of the governor, Francisco de Villagra, and Mapuche headed by their Toqui Lautaro. It was a dawn surprise attack on Lauteras fortified camp between a wooded mountain and the shore of the Matakito River. Overview In early 1557, following the retreat of Lautaro after the Battle of Piteo, Francisco de Villagra felt strong enough to gather a strong force of soldiers and march south to aid the remaining cities against the Mapuche, besetting them. Discovering that the city of Santiago was now relatively unprotected, Lautaro evaded the army of Villagra, letting him pass to the south. He soon marched again towards Santiago gathering a new army of 6,000 men joined by allies under Panigualgo bringing it to 10,000 men. However once the army reached the banks of the Mataquito River, Lautera's treatment of the local Indians in a manner similar to that of the Spaniards had created many enemies and after a quarrel with his ally over this mistreatment, most of the allies and many of the Mapuche refused to follow him. He moved over a league upriver from Laura and established himself in a fortified camp in a place called Mataquito. Villagra became aware that the location of the camp had been betrayed by local Indians previously abused by Lautaro. Villagra sent word to Juan Godinez near Santiago to meet him as he hurriedly returned from the south with 70 men. The unified force of Francisco de Villagra and Juan Godinez came to 120 men, with 57 horsemen, 5 arcabazeros and more than 400 janacuna made a surprise night march over the hills of Corner, to the one overlooking the Lauteras camp, on the shore of the Mataquito River. Villagra sent a body of Spanish infantry with arquebus or swords and shields into the Carrizal under Gabriel de Villagra. At dawn Villagra made his surprise attack on the camp. The infantry burst into the fortress while Juan Godinez and Villagra led the charge of the cavalry down the hill against the fortress with their Indian allies in advance. In the beginning of the battle they killed Lautaro, coming out of the doorway of his Ruka. When the Spaniards shouted Lautaro was dead, the allied warriors from Atata, Nubal and Renegel and fled any way they could leaving only Lauteras Mapuche fighting a six-hour battle putting up a stubborn resistance despite the death of their leader. At the end of the battle Lautaro and from 250 to 500 Mapuche were killed while the Spaniards lost Juan de Villagra and over half of their Yanacona, killed or wounded along with many of the Spaniards' horses. Lauteras' head was then taken and displayed in the main plaza of Santiago.